Hey everyone, Lee Goldstein here from 10 Minute Trades, and I want to welcome you to this week's Trade of the Week. So let me show you what took place in the trade room midweek, 3 a.m. in the morning. You got to get up early sometimes to have a good winner. Take a look. The German economy is the largest Eurozone economy, and at 3.30 in the morning on August 23rd, there's a manufacturing services report that we used to get up all the time in 3 a.m. in the morning to trade the French version of the report and the German version. They were both moving great. Well, France did not move very much this week, but watch what happened when we traded the German report. Those X's, as you know, are the orders that we put on the chart. They get transmitted to the exchange. A very big explosion hits both my targets. I did slightly shrink my target, which was unnecessary because look at the price. It just kept continuing down, down, and down. Fantastic, fantastic move on German flash manufacturing. Services PMI is what that event is called. If you notice here on the right on the news, the manufacturing was negative. The services and the composite were also negative, but the problem and the reason the report probably looks so negative and why it went down so much, we were trading the Euro futures on the Ninja Trader platform. The German manufacturing was starting at a forecast of 38.7. 50 and above is considered good. So they were not expecting very good manufacturing numbers. And in fact, they were a little bit better, but they're still quite bad. And all of the other news related to that event was negative. So we had a big burst down on the news and we were able to profit nicely from that event. Okay, so watch this move again. It was huge. Price bursts down, bad manufacturing news, bad services news, nothing good about the German economic news on that report. Pushes the euro down very far, giving us a beautiful profit of over $212 in nanoseconds. It was a very fast trade. And I've said this many, many times before. If you notice that we are getting up at 3 in the morning to take a mid-morning trade like that, Eastern time, then you know that we think there's a great opportunity for profit on that event. And we had two events that might have had good profit. It was just a fluke that the French report didn't really move, and then the German report was explosive, as you can see. But if we get up at a very unusual time and have a special trade room in the middle of the morning, early morning, 3 a.m., then you know there's a great opportunity for a profit. You should join us at that ungodly hour. So this is Lee Goldstein for this week's Trade of the Week. And please don't forget about our challenge. Come and sign up for the challenge. It's starting next week. It's going to be an awesome 10-day challenge. Make sure you take part in our education. We'd love to see you. Lee Goldstein signing out for 10-Minute Trades.